Hey everybody, welcome to our next episode of Delicious or Suspicious, and this is our fast food episode number two. Uh, today we're going to be comparing fast food chicken restaurants. So we have Popeyes, KFC, and Chick fil A, and we're going to walk through what you can get at all three. So again, our goal was to try to stay as close to 10 points as possible. So at Popeyes, we're going to have their small mashed potatoes with gravy and their two chicken tenders. It comes as three. They do six piece nuggets, but that particular restaurant didn't have it. So you can do ten, two tenders, I did spicy, uh, along with the mashed potatoes uh, for the 10 points. So we're gonna try this and we'll see. And that's obviously not a whole tender. That was like a, a piece of a tender that came up. So we'll try this one first. We'll give it a rating. Uh, we'll also let you know on the price. Uh, this meal was like $10. The Chick-fil-A sandwich was $7. And the KFC was um, the, the popcorn chicken was about four dollars so the KFC was the best value this was the most expensive so let's try this and we'll uh, we'll give it a rating we'll come back and try the other two here uh, if you haven't had Popeyes mashed potatoes they put a little bit of um, a little seasoning they like the Cajun seasoning in the gravy so it's got a little spice we want the spicy chicken um, as well so little flavor here no sauce needed So that's pretty good, pretty flavorful. Uh, I do like the spice in it, so we'll come back in just a second. We'll set up our um, KFC and we'll give you the, the stats on that one and we'll give you the, the score. So give me just one second. All right, we're back. We're gonna talk about the KFC, but I don't know if I told you on the Popeyes uh, on the previous part, uh, with the mashed potatoes and the two spicy tenders, that is right at 10 points. For KFC, I was trying to find something to mix together. You could do the green beans. Uh, I don't know how often you're gonna eat green beans at lunch. So we did the small popcorn chicken. This is eight points. You can add a sauce to it for two points. Uh, I asked for a sauce, unfortunately I didn't get one, so we're going to score it as it is today. We've got the popcorn chicken, again, eight points for their small popcorn chicken. I always like the flavor on KFC, it's always very good, so, uh, okay. Back in one second, we'll set up the Chick-fil-A and we'll give you our score and we'll rate delicious. So for Chick-fil-A, we went with the grilled chicken sandwich. On the green plan, you're right at eight points with the bun and everything that comes with. Uh, again, you can do some different sides, you, know, you can do the fruit cup or different things, but I thought, again, from a value standpoint, I thought I'd be way over on price if you went through the, um, the, the, the cost on Chick-fil-A. So I tried to stay with just a sandwich. You can see it is the largest of what we're going to have today. Um, this is a grilled chicken sandwich. Um, it's okay. Um, the food quality, I, I like the chicken sandwiches at Chick-fil-A, but not particularly the grilled chicken sandwich. We'll have a little piece here. Not bad. I'm gonna tell you for me, um, it's my wife's favorite choice here. This is actually gonna be her lunch here in a second. Cause I'm not gonna eat all these 30 points today. This is what my wife has. I think it's, I would rate this at the bottom. It's fine. Um, you know, it's a chicken sandwich. It's, uh, you know, it's, I would say it's probably a two for taste, for value it's three. Um, overall it's fine. It just wouldn't be my first choice. I would say the tough one's gonna be between the KFC. I actually do like the popcorn chicken a little better than the tenders, um, but I think um, getting the mashed potatoes at Popeyes gives you a little bit more flavor. And again, uh, the Popeyes is the most expensive, the KFC is the cheapest, but I still think just from a flavor standpoint, and you don't have to do the whole meal, you can do the tenders and the mashed potatoes separately, uh, and it'll cost you about the same. So you're right around six or seven dollars. Um, so I'm gonna go today, I'm gonna give the KFC Three points for taste, three points for value. Again, I think delicious, I would have that. I just don't know how full I would be. And then I would talk about, uh, on the Popeyes, uh, I would give it a four on taste, a three on value, and overall, that's gonna be our winner of delicious or suspicious for our fast food episode for chicken. Couple of things that I noticed today that were interesting. Uh, Chick-fil-A has amazing customer service. Everyone knows that. Um, but I went to Chick-fil-A first, then Popeyes and KFC. Uh, and the service got worse everywhere I went, like noticeably. Like Popeyes was pretty good. KFC was their typical awful service. So if that matters to you as well, that Chick-fil-A, you're gonna be in, in and out much faster, much more pleasant experience. So if that kind of you wanna factor that in, Chick-fil-A does give you a nice job there. Uh, KFC, for whatever reason, is just around here is always horrendous with their customer service. And Popeyes isn't too bad. It's a newer Popeyes in the area. So I think they're doing a pretty nice job. Um, the other thing I noticed is, again, just the cost. We're spending about twice as much money today to go to the chicken restaurants as we did the burger restaurants, which 
Uh, seems crazy to me, but I guess the price of chicken has gone up to compared to beef. I thought the beef prices had gone up, but chicken is a lot more expensive in these avenues versus what you would get for the comparable beef sandwich. Um, so that's going to be this week's version of that. Our winner is going to be Popeyes. Fallback for me would be KFC. Third place would be Chick-fil-A, which I know is a huge upset for a lot of people as everyone loves Chick-fil-A. Next week we'll be test, uh, comparing two Mexican restaurants. Well, Mexican-American, right, as, as they get for fast food. Uh, Chipotle and Taco Bell. Once we get all those three winners together, we'll do our final week of Delicious or Suspicious, and we'll put all of our winners together and see who's going to come up on top uh, for our Delicious or Suspicious Weight Watchers Fast Food Challenge. Thank you for checking out Mayhem Fitness. If you haven't done it so far, please hit that like and subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. New videos coming all the time. Have an amazing day, and we'll talk to you soon.